Hey friends, today I'm going to make an audio amplifier using the basic IC LM386. It is an basically an operational amplifier IC which can be used to amplify the input signal to the 20 to 200 times stronger output signal. The pin configuration, we can see that the first and eighth pin is of gain. These two pins control the gain of IC. You can vary the gain of IC from 20 to 200. If we connect nothing to these pins, the gain of IC is only 20. If we connect some capacitance, then gain of IC will increase. It will become 20 to 30, 40 up to 200 according to the highest capacitance. The highest capacitance that can be used in this IC across first and eight pin is one microfarad. More than one microfarad the IC doesn't work. Many of the electronic circuit of this IC will available on internet. They are of large number of components. They make large number of components but I'll modify this to make by less number of components you will just need only some components like breadboard and LM386 IC one speaker microphone three capacitors two resistors and some connecting leads and also one DMM. So let's start the making of connections. This is the IC I placed in on breadboard. First of all, see the circuit. Oh, the circuit is too complex. I'll give you a simple circuit which I make on paper. According to my circuit, first of all, we connect second and fourth pin with a connecting wire fourth and second now make the input third pin is of input pin so we take a microphone oh there is a capacitance also available so we take a 0.22 microfarad capacitor to make the input. We take electrolytic capacitor so we should take care of positive and negative of the capacitor. The positive of capacitor is connected to the third pin and input is connected to the negative pin of capacitor one lead of microphone is connected to negative of capacitor and another lead wire will be connected to the ground ground means fourth pin so it's done the output will be coming out from the fifth pin of the IC. We take an 470 microfarad capacitor to take output. Here also positive electrolytic capacitor is taken. So we take care of positive and negative. Positive will be connected to fifth pin and negative will be connected to the output here our output is and speaker so we connect the output wire the another wire of the output will be connected to ground for the less distortion in the signal we connect additional component like resistor and capacitor one kilo ohm resistor will connect it to third pin and ground. Third pin means 
input and ground some part of input will goes to ground a capacitor and a resistor will connected to output 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 to ground so some part of input will go through the ground and some of part of output will go through ground so less distortion will occur so it's an final circuit we will connect some power supply this will be positive power supply and this will be negative as i said said that first and eighth pin is of gain the gain will increase if we connect some capacitance across it but i don't need more than 20 gain so i will leave them unconnected this circuit is on breadboard so it's a temporary circuit i make same circuit on pcb here i use a 3.5 mm male jack to input the laptop audio into the ic and attach a speaker for output i am also attach a 3.5 mm female audio jack to take output to earphone or woofer so i'll show you some music let's attach a battery battery is connected now and give the input this is your input and play so guys this is the audio amplifier using lm386 so guys it is an amplifier this is one channel amplifier cause i use only one ic if you use two ic from different from stereo left channel and right channel you can make a on woofer so keep watching my videos and keep making something new with existing electronics